Hey guys, Nurse Mike here, and welcome to SimpleNursing.com. Now, before we get today's lecture started, please remember to access your free quiz and preview our cool nifty new study guides not here on YouTube. Click the link right up here at any time during this video. All right, guys, let's begin. Hey guys, Mike Linares here, and welcome to SimpleNursing.com. Today we're talking about electrolytes, or electric light. <laughs> Electrolytes are found in the fluids and they light up your body with this electric energy. So I call them the underwater electric disco dance party of the body. Because please remember this one token of information. Where fluids flow, electrolytes go! Electrolytes are ions that are found in your body fluids. They help to conduct electricity and energy, which helps control body fluids and maintain homeostasis this balance of the body. Basically, they help the body send messages from cell to cell and nerve to nerve and organ to organ, kind of like little paper boys relaying vital messages all over the body. So without them, your body, your brain, and basically your life would cease to function. So today we'll be going over three things. First of all, what disrupts electrolyte function? Secondly, which foods have the most electrolytes? Something that select all that apply questions love to ask you on your nursing tests. And also third, electrolyte values and priorities. Laboratory values that you will be tested on like for sure. Also priority signs and symptoms, nursing assessments, as well as those crucial nursing interventions. Basically everything that you should have highlighted in your book. So I'm taking the guesswork out of it and highlighting the book for you. We're only covering the most important things that love to show up on nursing exams and ultimately the end club. Now, as mentioned before, electrolytes help you pass electricity to the brain and to the nerves, but mainly used in our skeletal muscles, helping them to squeeze and contract from the muscles in the heart to the muscles in our deep tendons, even to the muscles in your intestinal tract, also known as your GI tract. Now, if you ever played sports or even talked to a personal trainer at the gym, you probably heard something about electrolytes. Even a coach has probably told you, you gotta drink your Gatorade to increase electrolytes. And even team moms will give out oranges at baseball games to increase electrolytes. And this whole time, you've probably been thinking, thanks for watching. For our full video and new quiz bank, click right up here to access your free trial. And please consider subscribing to our YouTube channel. Last but not least, a big thanks to our team of experts helping us make these great videos. All right, guys, see you next time.